I'm Chick McGee, and here's Tom Griswold. What's that? What do you have? A pile of laundry over there? What are you doing? Mm -hmm. There, that pile of pink stuff. What oh, is that? Oh, I, just, I have some hats over here. A lot. Of How hats. many hats do you got? I have quite a few of these. You have cool. three pink hats, four pink hats? No, I got about ten of them. Yeah, you do. Why do you have ten of them? <laughs> because he's weird. And then I wash them in the uh, dishwasher. In the, the oh, uh, dishwasher? Okay. Yeah, you put hats in the dishwasher in the top shelf. And just don't put them in the dryer. You're but. the weirdest person. <laughs> no, you want your hats clean, right? I have never washed a hat. Willie, have you washed a hat? <laughs> no, also, if you have 10 hats, why do you have to clean them? Just rotate them. <laughs> just rotate them. You Ace, can get a you milliner. washed a hat? Once. Chick? They make the little uh, plastic, uh, ha they look like giant plastic hats. Yes, yeah, they make a little mold. Yeah, you don't need mold, that. Just no. put them in the top shelf of your dishwasher. <laughs> now, how often do you wash your hat? It sounds like every day. I usually put them in the dishwasher with the dog bowls every night. Every, every night? night. The yeah. dog bowls every night? Yeah, you got to wash the dog bowls. Oh, God, I don't wash my dog bowls. I rinse them out, maybe. Mm. Do you use the slow-eating dog bowls or the regular? Um, I have the slow-eating dog mats. Do you have those? Where mm. you hide the food in the mat? Oh, it's good. Oh, dogs love forever. Those. Have you seen the slow watering bowl that has that, that little lid on it? And yeah, it's really it really works well. Yeah, slow, I have one of those. The yeah. slow eating bowl is great, at the, but I like to wash them every you know twice a day. You wash them after breakfast. Twice a day. Wash, yeah, you want dogs having clean You're bowls. You're a freak. Too, too much. That's too much. That's you wash your hat every day. I wash one of them. Man. <laughs> Don't you want a clean hat just every I, day? Just though? when I thought, you know. Wow. Those, Dog bowls, bottom shelf, hat, top shelf. Well, you could never walk into a baseball locker room. Mm -mm. Some of the oldest hats you'll ever smell. No, no. <laughs> no it's very so well, The people that live with you should wear medals around their neck. Are you familiar with I very rarely see them. <laughs> Man. <laughs> have, you, have, you heard the, have you heard the term extra? <laughs> You're extra. Oh, thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, new house have separate quarters, doesn't it? No, no, no. <laughs> I just, I'm, I'm doing, doing uh, chores most of the time. Hey, do you, have, do you have a room in your new place? Like, for you? Like I have a, an office. Like a Tom office? I have, oh, I have an office. Oh, nice. Yeah. I haven't decorated it yet. It's pretty barren. Okay. White desk, walls. chair, your typical office. My desk is the old door from my old house. Oh, that's that's super cool. From 1933. Uh, uh, Doesn't the knob get in the way of things? Yeah. No. <laughs> what about the, the knob's knob? on it? Yeah, the knob's on it. <laughs> It's got, it's it's got a letter. The glass. knob is on it. <laughs> yeah, it's, you've seen it. It's a huge... Certainly you filled in the mail slot, though. <laughs> uh, I, wish I keep added. dropping my papers. Do you it's have fine. glass on top of it? It's got a... Um, Leaded glass window of the size of like a notebook. So that's still. A, it was the original. Door. The house was my old house was built in 1933. Okay. If the girls want to talk to him, they come in. They ring the doorbell a couple of times. Daddy, which, Daddy. which original the house? The house you grew up in in Cleveland? <laughs> no, no, the one that I used to live in here it was built in 1930. So when they when they redid the house, the door was uh, not a perfect fit. So we just got a new door made. But I took the old one. It's really funky old wood. It's great. It's beautiful. Hmm. And turned into a desk. If it were a mail slot, if the mail slot were still on there, it would be a perfect shredder. Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that would be fun. Oh, my God, that's a great... I wonder if I could add one, or would that <laughs> yes. take away from the authentic... Do it. Uh, okay. it would, yeah, it would. <laughs> could you get a doggy door, and then one of the dogs could just pop their head up while you're working? <laughs> I mean, that would be a joyful moment every uh, every time you're working on something. Yeah, yeah these taxes suck. Hey! <laughs> you always ask our celebrity guests a lot of times what they have in their office, what special... What would you put in your new office that would be special? Like, is there a photograph or an autograph? Right, right, right now, there literally is nothing in there. That's why I'm asking you, what would, what do you want to put in there? Um, What's the first thing you're going to? Thank you, Chick. The first photo. What are you going to do? Do you think? Uh, probably something too kids? personal to discuss on the radio. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Now everyone's sad. So, are you happy, you so fools? Here's, here, I hope on, you're all happy. Tom, here's what we're dealing with. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here's what uh, our listeners, God love them, are hanging right, in there. Right, right. But uh, I speak on behalf of the people in the room. You don't pay attention. Right. <laughs> you're completely lost all the time. Check. You can't do two things at once. Check. You can't read and pay attention or pay attention and read. He once claimed you can't. 
think and, and talk. talk. I can't talk. Think talk. Think talk. I've, said, I've stated that clearly. I can't yeah. think and talk at the same time. And so. now there's topics, evidently, that you don't want to talk about on the radio. But insists that we, guests who come in yes. have to. Of course. Yeah. And yes. if they don't answer the way he wants them to, well, that was a terrible interview. <laughs> yeah. Well, what was wrong with him? Not very bright. If uh, there was a uh, micro uh, talent bigger than that, I haven't met them. <laughs> I'll have to, I have to decide what I'm going to put up in the office. Okay. That's that's great decorating your own office. You see the hill we're climbing. Yeah, right. I'm sorry. Yeah. No, I just I do, I'm just <laughs> do taking my time. Do you have a style? Do, are you boho oh, chic? Do are I have you? a style? Yeah, no. That's the answer. <laughs> do you have a credenza? You gotta have a nice credenza. I don't know what that means. So this is your version of the uh, resolute desk. Is that right? The uh, the door and the whole thing. It's not off a ship. Oh, get a lower here. button, oh. please. Get a lower button. Get a lower button. Lock everybody uh, I can't. inside. You can't oh. do that. Can't lock the door. It's those sliding. You've been in there. It's those big sliding glass things. Oh man. Why would you get an office? You can't do weird creepy you know those stuff. Things that the, <laughs> yeah. It's like a barn door it hangs yes. on a hinge. Barn those, doors, yeah. Yeah, you know, they're glass. You can't glass barn doors. You can't lock them. Wow. Are they frosted glass? So you at least have some privacy? No, why would I need privacy in my office? To whack it. <laughs> <laughs> well, you, you don't porn. have an office. Uh, yeah. no. You know what? I saw on like the home show, one of those shows, somebody in their office had you grab a book and then you open it and it opens a secret cabinet yes. and this guy has his bourbon and his cigars in there. Now you don't like anything cool, so you could keep your Metamucil and your floss sticks in there. Yeah. All your weird little pens that you like. I have a friend stool softener. Stool yeah. softener. Sure, All pop. Right. Put whatever you want in there. Do you ever do stool softener with your Metamucil? <laughs> <laughs> it's Gosh. like doing a double line. Latte. That's the weirdo <laughs> speedball right there. I have a friend who has a secret speakeasy in his house. You go in there, you push a button, you pull out a book, and this door opens up. It is so cool. It is so I am cool. surprised Tom doesn't have a panic room. Me? Oh, do you have a panic room? This whole house is a panic room. <laughs> he walks in the front of the room. <laughs> With the dishwasher. With the dishwasher? Yes, yes, of course. <laughs> <clears throat> maybe a maybe a laundry too. Do you have a uh, bathroom off your office? You should probably do that. Well, there's a bathroom on the on the. There's a parlor bathroom. No, you know what I mean. In the office. You no, no, no. There's go into separate. a door and there's your bathroom. You should probably do that. It's too late. <laughs> Why? Well, it's never too late. I'm sure they can whip that out. And there's a bathroom just right around the corner. <laughs> Three or four years. Well, do that you, would make you, uh, you putting one in your office. Do you have all, a parlor bathroom at your easy. house, so if there are guests over, they don't have to go into your bedroom to use the bathroom? Yeah, yeah. I've got a hall and, uh, and a parlor. Yeah. yeah, there you go. Yeah, That's nice. Do you have that, Josh? Yes, I do. Well, most mm -hmm. homes do. Um, you yeah, not all of them, but some. You really don't think we have <laughs> real lives, do you? We're Why don't just... we do the Bob and Tom home tour? We Let's... go to everybody's uh, house. And then guess whose is whose? <laughs> that would be easy to do, but... Now, when we walk in yours, do, do, is there something to let you know that it's your house? The dogs? I don't know. Besides the be... flame marks over the stove? I don't have flame marks <laughs> over the stove, Josh. There's no stove. I don't smoke, cook. Smoke stains. <laughs> now, is the, Haitian, is the Haitian love swing just in the bedroom? Is there one? <laughs> How long would it take someone to figure out that it was your house? Not very so are I there mean, pictures of you? And not really. There's pictures of my family, my kids, and stuff. Well, I have those. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> no, these you walked in my house, there are pictures of everyone's Christie's fully daughters. clothed. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> in Christie's I have pictures. Most of my artwork the kids did. I really like that. That's nice. That Willie, you you're have you married, you have a nice house, and you have a, a room that's empty, and she goes, you know what? Do whatever you want with it. What do you make? Um, I would, I mean, kind of boring, but I'd put like a desk with a couple of like podcast mics in there just in case so I can have buddies over. We can sure. do stuff. I would put a, I do a video game room. <laughs> I wanted my own fridge in there, but I don't want it to look like a fridge. I want it to look like a car or a guitar. I haven't enough time to think about it. All the right. Guitar amp. There's a guitar amp fridge. See, so cool. Christy, she's yeah. helping me out. She's my interior designer. Sure. Gotcha. Yes. And I got all my sodas. I got all my drinks in there, all my little coffee. Oh, I got Gatorade on tap. I have a tap system or a soda gun. <laughs> I got Gatorade. Uh, I got whiskey. Very good. I got diet coke. <laughs> <laughs> and I make a weird cocktail called Willie's Revenge, and it's Gatorade, whiskey, and diet coke. <laughs> That's fun. Very nice. Good. Thank you. Now, Ace, Ace at your place, how long would it take before I knew it was your place? Are there, uh, any, are there any Ace Cosby, I think like, the with VCRs your band poster? Would... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the wall of VCRs probably would. When you come down the main hallway and you uh, turn right towards the kitchen, there's a... Uh, uh, Eric Clapton, platinum black with my name on it. So. Wow. 
That's a pretty cool. Really? I think the bong in my dish rack would kind of give it away if anybody <laughs> came to my house. So you're, do you think I'm weird because I put my hats in the dishwasher? You put your bong in the dishwasher? I cleaned my bong twice yesterday. A clean <laughs> bong is a happy bong, you guys. Aren't you cleaning out all the residual... Well, it makes more sense to clean a bong than a hat. Yeah. No, isn't the bong supposed to be full of what's it called, resin? You don't want resin in there. It makes it stink. Yeah, it's not like a cast iron skillet. You want it actually... <laughs> You don't, you don't yeah. just wash it with water. My it's grandfather rough. seasoned this volcano. <laughs> <laughs> well, you can't get any any smoke out of it, but 